uh, Senator wishes to estimate proportion of United States voters who favor abolishing electoral college. How large a sample is needed in order to be 98% confidence that the sample proportion will not differ from the true proportion by more than 3%. So we have to find sample size. And we are given that the so margin of error is 3%. So E is uh, 3%, 0 0.03, and confidence level is 98%. So they, uh, because we are not given pre uh, previous uh, estimates, so we would use this equation to determine the sample size, uh, 0 0.25 times Z sub four by two plus E and squared. So first we have to find Z sub alpha by two. So here confidence is 98 percent so it means that so we would have uh, alpha would be two percent right so we will be having alpha is equal to uh, two percent so 0 0.02 so we would have z sub alpha by two so that would be equal to z sub alpha is 0 0.02 divided by two so zero point and we can find its value from the normal distribution table uh, that turned out to be like say uh, 2.33 so just uh, if you don't know so let me just remind you how we do it so we can draw like say normal distribution curve and this z sub alpha by 2 so this would be this cutoff point so z sub 0 0.01 where this side, this area is here, 0 0.01, and then remaining 0.99 would be this area. And from the table, we go and see that when the area on the left is 0 0.99, so that Z value here, so that is 2.33. So you can verify this one. And now just plug in this value here in the uh, in this equation here, and then uh, get the answer. So n would be equal to 0 0.25, 2.33 divided by 0 0.03, and square it. And this computes into 1508. And we always uh, round it up. When we find a sample size, so after the computation, whatever the answer we get, we just round it up to the next integer. So sample size one thousand five hundred 